I am really, really nervous right now. Bungie, don't be nervous, mate. We're nearly there. It's mate. nearly over, mate. We're home. We're in the home straight, brother. We've got a very special guest now. We've got a special guest? Mate, we're going to have special guests every no, Wednesday night. I'm talking tonight. about a special, special guest. Uh, how special? Ladies and gentlemen, and Dougie, hold on oh, to yourself, mate. Don't, don't Please, mate, me. welcome the one and only Kylie Minogue. <laughs> I'm not nervous now, Joe. I just got a kiss on Kylie. It was fantastic. Now, Kylie, look, it was great of you to fly halfway around the world just to be here for just our premiere. Just you guys, yeah. Absolutely magnificent. Now, you've rubbed shoulders with some of the biggest names in showbiz. You've been interviewed by, look, the great ones, the Clive Jameses and these sort of people in the world. But nothing compared. Nothing could compare to this, surely. <laughs> now, we must say you're, uh, you're touring for basically the whole of June. Yeah. Now, the four Melbourne shows sold out in less than 20 minutes. Can you believe that? I can hardly believe it. I mean, what a welcome home. It's just incredible. In actual fact, you've announced two extra shows. There is one at the Palais in Melbourne. That's on June 18. That's a Thursday. And one on Wednesday, June the 24th at the State Theatre in Sydney. So get in quick if you want your tickets or you will miss out. Now, there's one thing I'm dying to ask. You've had mm -hmm. a number of image changes over the years. It seems every couple of years we get a, a different sort of image. You managed to reinvent yourself. Mm -hmm. now, I must say, Dougie's the master of reinventing himself. I mean, oh, I can't, hang on a minute. Where do you no. see your next image going? Well, you've what gone you from, you've gone from... Which Dougie will it be? The boy from Braybrook. Yeah. Who couldn't talk, that played footy. Yeah. <laughs> and you've reinvented yourself into the boy from Braybrook. Now, who couldn't yeah. talk, that gave up footy. <laughs> Don't, 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 don't make a moment in front of Kylie who holds me in high regard. Please don't do it. Now, just, oh Is it a conscious effort to keep changing your image every couple of years? Oh, it's, it's, I find it a very natural process, you know. It's, it keeps me from uh, getting too bored and it's, it's something that, um, it's hard for me to explain really. I, maybe people are not... You know, they think back to 10 years ago and, and wonder why I've changed so much. But I think 10 years, you know, if, if we probably, if I got everyone here to get out your passport picture from 10 years ago, no we'd thanks. all probably look quite I suppose, Kylie, talking about changing, being based overseas now, mm -hmm. as Peter Allen used to sing, do you still call Australia home? Yeah, of course I do. You do? Yeah, I mean, you still call Australia home. I'm also dying to know, is it possible for you to do normal, everyday things? I mean, look, we've got our own version, James Hood, who gets mobbed everywhere he goes. He's the cute blonde guy right down the bottom there. Now, it must be... It must, it must really be impossible for you to go out in public without getting virtually attacked. Um, it's a, I, I do normal things, yeah, of course, but I'm always wary or conscious that people... That people recognise me everywhere, but it's just something I've... I'm used to. Kylie, we've seen you acting in Neighbours. Now yeah. we've seen you sing many a great hit. What do you prefer, singing or being an actress? Um, both, definitely. I mean, I found that for for singing in the past ten years, acting has come in handy, doing videos and appearing on different shows. Um, mm. But I'd, I would like to do a, a serious film in the future. We've done a couple. You did Street Fighter with Jean-Claude Van Damme, Ooh, if you don't mind. That was a good show. <laughs> we don't need to mention these. And Biodome. Mm. That was a lot of fun. I, I actually enjoyed that. I watched My it on video. My father told me never to watch it, so I never will watch it. <laughs> oh, that's a nice one. <laughs> yeah. And Kylie, since you're here with a couple of footballers, you must follow the AFL. You know a lot about the AFL. Anyone in your family follow the footy? My mother, hi mum, I know she'll be watching. She follows football. Does she, she, she follow? She, she barracks for about five teams. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it depends who's playing and she'll pick one and just be, my dad has to leave the room sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> now look, um, we've actually, we're running out of time and it's an absolute shame because we could pester the living daylights out of you all night. We're going to do head kickers after break. Would you like to stick around and be a part of that? Head kickers? Yes. You know what that is? No. <laughs> Hang around, what does this It will be a lot of fun, trust me. Stick around, we'll do head kickers <laughs> next. Yeah. Yeah. Well, Adam, as promised, 
finally stuck around to take part in head kickers. <laughs> She's going to kick the footy for you. Now, not only do you pick up great prizes, also the $1,000 if Kylie's good enough to hit the nominated head, you will also pick up a, speci a special Kylie pack. This consists of concert tickets, the chance to meet Kylie in person, which we've had the great pleasure oh. of doing, her complete CD collection <laughs> and a bottle of Solly's Genuine Russian Vodka. You might have to let that ferment a couple of years before you get into it, mate. I'm feeling a bit nervous. I'm not quite sure what I've let myself in for. And I need to ask you, have sympathy for me. When was the last time you kicked the footy in your stilettos? Um, Dougie wears them a bit. Let me tell you right well, I cross dress a bit at night after about 9.30, so... <laughs> All right, Adam, who would you like Kylie to aim for? Uh, cannot go past old blue eyes, I think. Okay. <laughs> oh, could you have picked a hard target? <laughs> top Got right hand corner. Top. It's okay. Oh. Come on, Kylie. Give it your best shot. Come on, let's go, Kylie. Up. <laughs> Fire away, Kylie. Wait. Wait. Just got to pull my. Pull the socks up. <laughs> I'll help you there. Pull no. up, Dougie. Okay, ready. Get that one out of the way. Come up, come right up here. But don't, don't go over the edge, whatever you do. One more, one more, one more. A little bit lower, a little bit lower. Oh, not bad. We'll give you a chop, man, Dougie. Can you kick ready, the footy? Ready? Dougie will show you how to do it. <laughs> Can we have a footy? Doug, you're going to have, have another go. Have, okay, we'll let a couple go. We've got to get one. Go. Oh, we got one. There we go. Who did we get, James? Bill Clinton. President Bill Clinton. Number 10, Village Number 10, Roadshow. Number 10, here we go. Number 10 is Village Roadshow. Congratulations, you're one of private theatre screening the City of Angels, starring Meg Ryan and Nicholas Cage. For 20 people, including snacks and drinks, as well as a double pass to every roadshow premiere for 12 months. pick up Adam? Absolutely over the moon, can't describe my emotion. Fantastic, I'll tell you what we're going to do, we're also going to throw in the Kylie pack, so that's a sensational pick up for you, Adam. Now, if you would like to be a part of Head Kickers, all you have to do is call us on this number. And Football fantastic. lessons, I'm sorry, I should Okay, have. we're going to go on a break, in the meantime we'll give Kylie a few kicking lessons. Everyone, thank you, Kylie, for those.